people are devoted to answering God's call to service? Well, Billy Graham was, and his commitment to evangelism has taken him all over the world to every nation. Billy Graham is recognized as the legendary evangelist whose legacy has impacted people all over the world. In the next few minutes, I would, uh, I would like to share with you the legacy and journey of Billy Graham and the impact he has made as a preacher. Billy Graham is a unique and remarkable man. His earlier years were interesting. First, Billy was born just outside Charlotte, North Carolina on November 7, 1918. He was the oldest of four children and was raised in a devout Presbyterian family. He helped raise dogs, cats, goats, mules, and horses on his family farm. In high school, Billy was known for being rebellious, and he was also known for having a new girlfriend every day. By the age of 16, he responded to a sermon held in Charlotte and, became, uh, and came to Christ in salvation. In Bible College in Tampa, Florida, on a golf course at midnight, Billy had made his final decision to become a preacher. For the following two years, Billy practiced preaching on everything, from birds outside to the people in uh, taverns and saloons. After Florida Bible Institute, Billy continued his education at Wheaton College in Illinois. Billy Graham's life was changed when God gave him a partner. In June 1943, Billy and his fiancée, Ruth Bell, graduated from Wheaton College. In August 13, 1943, Billy and Ruth got married in Montreal, North Carolina. That year, Billy had become pastor of the Village Church in Western Spring, and many people attended that church, and many came to faith there. Billy Graham was discovered by a nation. He started as an evangelist with Youth for Christ that helped teenagers. In 1949, in Los Angeles, in his first major crusade, Billy Graham inspired a gangster, Jim Voss, to come to know Christ, according to Janet Lowe's book, Billy Graham Speaks. Billy Graham was all over the press in the Times, Newsweek, and Life magazines at that time. He appeared more in the media than any other U.S. president. Billy Graham's legacy has impacted the world. He was devoted to sharing the gospel with the world. He has expanded his crusade into all public commu communication media. In 1950, his group found at Worldwide Pictures that made religious films. In 1954, his um, in his trip to Germany, that same year, the Germans proclaimed that Graham was God's machine gun. He then travels to Asia to share the gospel. In January of 1956, Billy traveled to India and was well received by the people of that country. That, uh, that February, he went to the Philippines and helped many Catholics convert to Christ. He also crusaded in Hong Kong, Taiwan, Japan, and Korea. Since then, Billy has been back to those same countries and have had live audiences as uh, large as a million people. Then he decided to take the gospel to the ends of the earth. 1959, he and his team went to Australia, and 22,000 uh, 22, people came forward to receive Christ at that invitation. Um, and that's according to his autobiography, Just As I Am. At the beginning of 1960, in his trip to Africa, he witnessed mis many Muslims uh, convert to Christ. Billy Graham is a noble man to be admired by all. Today, Billy Graham has written 24 books that have won many awards. He has met every U.S. president from Dwight Eisenhower to um, George Bush. In 1983, he was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom by uh, President Reagan. And um, then in 1996, Billy and Ruth Graham both received the Congressional Med Gold Medal. Although Billy Graham said as a young boy he would never grow up to be a preacher, God showed him that he had different plans for him. In his humble and compassionate approach in presenting the message of truth, he has been able to effectively reach millions of people to Christ. His passion and devotion to Christ and to delivering his message is the reason today he's considered the nation's preacher and the world's most famous evangelist. Even today, he still remains a true man of God and a man of great influence. Thank you.